Hi, in this video I'm going to explain how to block a heavy topspin attack. Um, a common problem players have when trying to block heavy topspin is the ball just shoots up off their bat and goes long past the end of the table. Um, I know this problem very well as I used to really struggle with um, heavy topspin but thankfully the solution is quite simple and with a bit of practice um, you should find it quite easy to block heavy topspin. So first of all, let's talk about where players go wrong. Um, there's two classic mistakes which pit players make. Um, number one, and the most common, is a player just having their bat angle too open. So when the ball comes in, the ball shoots up in that direction. Um, number two, um, a player often stands up a bit too tall. They see this top spin coming in, they stand up, and that just changes their bat angle ever so slightly, and the ball shoots up and long. Um, let's take a look at it, an example of this. So you can see from that clip that Neela's bat, it, it's just too open. So as the topspin attack comes in, the ball bounces up and goes long. You know, and even if it was to have landed on the table, um, it'd be pretty easy for me to attack the next ball because the ball would be nice and high. So you can probably see where this is going. If you want to block heavy topspin, you need to do two things. Number one, you want to get yourself nice and low. Number two, you want to close your bat angle. Now, when the ball spins in, the ball's going to shoot off at this angle rather than this angle if my bat is more open. Okay, the heavier the top spin, the more I'm actually going to need to close my bat angle. Let's take a look at how this should be done. So from that clip, you can now see Neela's bat angle is much more closed. She's staying low and the ball goes low over the net. Um, and that's gonna make it much harder for me to then attack the next ball. Um, to begin with, I'd recommend just keeping your blocking stroke just quite short and simple. Just work with the speed and spin already on the ball rather than trying to inject your own speed into the rally. If the shot is fast and you get a simple block in, that ball is going to go back fast anyway. Okay? So your blocking action should just be a short movement towards the ball. Okay? Nothing more than that. And you can do that with your backhand or your forehand. Just a short simple block. When you get very comfortable doing this, um, you can try blocking a bit faster. Um, to do this, you're just going to extend your stroke a little bit more and play with a bit more acceleration. But make sure that your bat angle is still closed, okay? If you can get a quick block in, then you really put your opponent under some very serious pressure and you can often just get winners without the other player getting anywhere near the ball with a quick block. Um, let's have a look at another example, this time with a fast block. So there you go. So if you find it difficult to block heavy topspin, start with a simple block to begin with, stay low, close your bat angle, and then try doing some quicker blocks too. So I hope you found this uh, video useful. For more table tennis tips, please visit my website at tabletenniscoach.me.uk.